we've written to Richard Lockhead on a number of occasions asking him to use this power uh, and he's chosen not to do so. Uh, that's why I was so confused when he said actually I don't have any power and I'm lo now lobbying for it. Uh, the Dutch government have already used this power to exclude large numbers of non-farmers such as Schiphol Airport. He needs to now rethink again and look at what they're doing and try and import it into Scotland and use the powers that are at his disposal. I mean, what actually are those powers at the moment? What farmers would it allow the Scottish Government to exclude? Well, uh, from what the Dutch Government have done, they've named a whole list of, of, uh, of different organisations and people that they declare are non-farmers, rather than trying to, do, to, to actually uh, set out what is a farmer. They've set out who is not a farmer. So I would imagine that it would allow you to take out big uh, organisations that have no agricultural interests, you would take out speculators, and you would take out that reporter who claimed on Panorama that she'd become a, a farmer, because if she had no agricultural activity, then she could be uh, struck out in the list and made not to be able to claim the, the uh, subsidies. So I, I think there is real scope within the current powers that uh, the Minister has had since uh, 1st of January 2010 to take action and try and end this uh, illegal pr or this outrageous practice.